Getting roped into the mindset of complacency anytime there's the risk of stored energy release, is not the way to avoid incident and or injury. In the bitter end, stored energy can be a fatal force to be reckoned with. Note, according to the original video source, both deckhands survived this incident with only minor injuries. Safety Learnings, compiled by, Safety Encyclopedia. At its essence, risk can be defined as a potential event that results in an outcome that is different from what is planned. Stored energy can be mechanical, gravitational, hydraulic, chemical, or pneumatic and refers to the energy stored in machines and equipment. Stored energy hazards exist because stored energy can be released accidentally and potentially cause serious injury. Unfortunately, Hazards related to stored energy are often misunderstood and not easily recognized. And according to the U.S. Department of Labor, nearly 10% of serious accidents are associated with failure to recognize and control stored energy. The work that tugs and towboats carry out is inherently risky. Tug masters should have a clear deck policy that does not allow personnel onto the towing area when the unit is being towed. The towing master should be aware that inexperienced personnel must not be exposed without training and supervision to carry out high-risk tasks. Personnel working on tugs have a responsibility for their colleagues' safety, in addition to their own. They should, 1. Wear approved personal protective equipment, PPE, hard hat, safety footwear, high visibility clothing etc. Personnel not wearing the correct PPE are exposed to increased risk. Tug masters should demand that their crews wear the appropriate PPE. 2. Wear approved and appropriate in date self inflating life jackets whenever on deck. Not using a life jacket when working on deck, boarding, tying up, or connecting up a barge can be hazardous. 3. Ensure that working areas are safe and free from trip or slip hazards, particularly around bollards. 4. Remain alert to the ongoing operations. 5. Listen to orders from the tug master. 6. Hold a line by the side of the aisle or the standing part. 7. Be aware of lines, towing or mooring, suddenly coming under tension. 8. Stay clear of snapback zones. To learn more safety item, don't forget to subscribe, Safety Encyclopedia and hit the bell icon.